Hello everyone, this is Scamper B. Bum here with another episode of Ratchet and Clank. Last time we explored more Pokotaru. In this episode, we're gonna explore the Blar facilities here and see if there's anything useful left on the planet. This area is going to be hopefully done in live commentary, but there may come a time I may have to do a lot of stuff in post. Because this is pretty hard of a level. As you can see right there, three bomb glove um, grenades could not take out that guy, even though he should be fairly easy to take down. Oop, see that little blue guy over there? Shoot, aww, oh, use the Devastator, it seems. Shoot him right away. He will wake up and start going around and waking up all the other enemies in the area that he's near. You can, could, probably sneak around without having to kill all these guys, but it's just for bolts right now. And later games, it's because you get experience towards weapons, but in this game, it's mainly for bolts. And just hold off on buying these three weapons until later. Oh, that's and as you can see up there in the corner, I went ahead and ground out, ground out some bolts by going to the hoverboard races on Blackwater City. Every time you set a new course record for time or for some, um, uh, what is it? Oh, for um, moo or. Moves? No, tricks. Every time you get a new uh, high score for trick, you get a thousand bolts from the race. So, just completing the race normally, just trying even a little, you get 2,000 bolts. Like, not like that without trouble. You're long. Ooh! Yeah, there's probably going to be a lot of that throughout this episode. Good thing that the checkpoint for this area is right there, right in front of the Gadgetron vendor. You want to go this way first, as you can see there is an uh, infobot over there. Think if you can sneak by these guys? Oh yeah, you can. Lock onto that guy. There we go. Ooh, yeah. You just barely are able to reach that ledge. And then you need these magnet boots that you get on this level to walk over all these metal plates. And as you noticed, you cannot use any weapons on these... Ventilation? Well, not really ventilation. Propane shafts, I'm guessing, because they're shooting out fire every so often. So you have to defend yourself with your wrench, but everything usually in front on the ventilation shaft, you can kill with the wrench in one swing. And you can't jump, so this is the maximum speed. If we have any more ventilation shaft like this, I'll just speed it up because it'll take a long time. Come to here, instead of just slingshotting over right away, pull up the taunter. Go down here, taunt the enemies into the forest field. You get a skill point, and take those enemies out without trouble. And yeah, I figure that it's just bolts down here. Just high, double jump up to there, and slingshot your way over, and keep following this info by. But how are all you guys doing? Right now, it's just the easy part of the level, just take out the enemies. I'm doing okay. Mmm, Ratchet ain't doing okay, because I can't seem to hit that guy. Eh, ignore him. Ooh. Bomb glove. Bomb glove these guys. Do Oblivion. Man, I forgot how useful the bomb glove was. One sec. Now I'm back. I decided to equip the mine glove, because if they start chasing after you like they are right now, 
they can do that. You can drop mines as you're running away. And be in the home free. I so hope I find some nano deck. Um, I don't want to deal with that right now. Now it looks like I have to. Ooh. Take that guy out so I don't have to fight everything. Oh. Come on. I forgot how many of these guys there were on this route. And there's one charging at me. Ooh, I don't like this. I know I have... I can take two hits, but I do not like this. I'm gonna throw a bunch of mines out. And... I'm guessing this would be a good spot if you did have it. The Glove of Doom. Have those little guys running around attacking these. Oh boy. Ah, oh, come on. Yeah, there's a Blarg Saucer from the last, uh, last area. I think two rockets take it out from the Devastator. But we gotta sneak through all these guys. I think the Devastator will take him out in two hits instead of three with the Bomb Glove. But it's also the Devastator, so it may not be as accurate as you want it to be. Ooh, boy. But this is coming up shortly. I got to mention about why I have 4,000 bolts. Is an upgrade that'll cost, I think in the end it costs 4,000 bolts to get. But right now we're just going to get the info bot for this episode. Follow it up. Yeah, over here. You want to follow it up and out over this way. Nice and slow. Hello again, everyone. Supreme Executive Chairman Drek here to fill you in on our progress. We have now found the perfect orbit for our planet, one which will allow for the optimum temperature all year round. However, there is a planet now occupying that orbit, and sadly, for its few insignificant inhabitants, it must be destroyed. And that's why we've created this! The Planet Buster Maximus, a device capable of blowing an entire planet into subatomic particles. We're quite proud of it. Here's how it works. We attach the Planet Buster to this ship, fly it into orbit around the planet, and let it go! Kaboom! <laughs> quite ingenious, really. Once our trained professionals put the finishing touches on our new planet, everything will be complete. Thank you. Goodbye. Now this guy's gonna blow up an entire planet? That's just... me! That's what I've been telling you. Look, I'm still gunning for Quark. If we end up taking out Drek too, hey, fine. What? You do care. Don't push it, pal. Well, that was jarring. It's supposed to show you gently panning around to that. You're now inside the same area that Clank was in, and I'm not going that without the pyro or pyroster out and going. I remember all the trouble I had as Clank in this area. But for some reason, the crab things aren't here. Hmm. But yet a bunch of the crates are. It's the big... no. I was gonna say, there's that big set of crates there. Uh, still there. But no. But I think that's going to be all for this episode. We got inf our Infobot to a new planet to try to stop Drek. Probably figure out where Quark is. And next time, we're going to explore that other pathway we didn't take. This is Scamper B Bum bidding you all adieu.